In our culture today, we don't do a very good job about teaching people what health is and how to maintain it. I think it's that people in general uh, have less confidence in themselves and look to external authorities. Uh, you know, I think it's a, it's a whole bunch of stuff, but it doesn't serve us well. And so Dr. Andrew Weil has made a name for himself in the field of health and wellness, pointing out where we've gone wrong and showing us how we can turn it around. As a society, we have done a very poor job in that We've managed to make unhealthy food cheap and healthy food expensive, and our eating habits over the past 50 years, I think, have gone steadily downhill. His books and lectures tell the benefits of eating fish, fresh organic fruits and vegetables, avoiding processed foods and unhealthy fats while reducing stress with breathing techniques and meditation. In my own medical education, I heard very little about healing and our ability to repair and regenerate and take care of ourselves. And I think that's where good medicine should start. It's that um, when I sit with a patient, I'm always asking myself, why is healing not happening? What can I do from outside um, to increase the likelihood of it? While has devoted decades to developing and teaching others about integrative medicine, which is a combination of both alternative and mainstream medical care, the focus is on the body's own healing abilities. It's that, that knowing that your body has the ability to take care of itself and then knowing that a lot of things under your control really influence your health, starting with how you eat, um, your physical activity, how you rest, how you sleep, what you do for fun. And there's no doubt we'll hear more from this man in the years to come. Dr. Weil has been named one of the most influential people in the world because of his contributions to the field of health and wellness. There's a lot of things that you can do to make sure that you stay healthy throughout most of your life.